Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're checking out games in that sweet spot between $10 and $15. Every game that we highlight is on sale at a brand new low price. That way you can shop with confidence, knowing you're getting a great deal. The Switch 2 may have been delayed a bit longer, but the eShop deals continue strong as always. Now yesterday we covered games under $10, and so if you happen to miss that video, I'll have it linked down below in a pinned comment, that way you can get all caught up. Thanks as always for hanging out, and with all that said, let's go ahead and dive in. Stay safe, my friends. Hack is a single-player metroidvania that offers us as players more than 20 hours of gameplay, and it comes in at just under 900 megabytes for the download. The game has multiple endings and adaptive difficulty that changes based on your skill level, and this ensures that everyone can work their way through the story, no matter what experience level you have. The art and animations are fully hand-drawn, and they look great, plus the combat itself is a lot of fun, and very creative. On top of that, the game is littered with secrets to find, and right now you can pick it up at an all-time low, marked down to just 11.34, with the deal ending on the 26th. Before the Night is a unique single-player adventure game with a heavy emphasis on storytelling and puzzle solving. It offers players roughly 3-5 to five hours of gameplay, and the download is just over 200 megabytes. Now what's cool about this game is that the world we play in has seen animals and humans having their roles reversed, and so we play as a young girl who's distraught by the death of her master, which just so happens to be a rabbit named Alice. We set out on an adventure to try to resurrect Alice, and that's how the story gets started. The art style is amazing, the music is top tier, and right now you can pick up this little gem for just 11.49, Mark down to half price with the deal ending on the 22nd. Up next we have Koa and the Five Pirates of Mara, which is a fun platform adventure game here on the Switch. It offers again about 3-5 to five hours of gameplay, and comes in with a download around 1.5 gigs. Now in this one we follow a young girl named Koa as she explores the different islands around her home, solving puzzles and working to defeat the different pirates that you'll come across on your adventure. It has a simple control scheme and it's a great game for both newcomers as well as those a bit more experienced and it's filled with charm. Each stage is full of secrets and collectibles and so there is a little replay value as well, especially for those of us that like to collect everything before moving on. They also switch up the way the levels play out quite a bit so it stays feeling fresh throughout the entire runtime. Right now you can grab it up for just $11.99, marked all the way down to a brand new low and the deal ends on the 19th. Bright Memory, the Infinite Gold Edition, is one of the better games I've played here on the Switch in recent years. It's basically a mashup of first-person shooting and action-based melee combat. The only downside is that the game can be completed in about two hours, but with that it also makes you feel as though you're playing through a high-intensity action movie, culminating in an epic conclusion that's reason enough to play the game by itself, in my opinion. You have plenty of firepower at your disposal with special ammo and cool gadgets that you can get access to as you work through the game. Overall it's really solid and right now you can pick it up for just $13.99, mark down 30% to an all time low and the deal ends on the 23rd. You need about 2.5 gigs for the install. 30XTX is another newer game here on the Switch, it's an action platformer and the follow up to the 2018 hidden gem 20XTX. Both games are heavily inspired by the classic Mega Man franchise. This one has a download around 1 gig, and it has local and online co-op for 2 players as well. Now you're given the option to play a few different characters, one is melee and the other has a ranged attack, and the game offers a couple of different ways to play through, with one sort of acting as an easy mode, but keep in mind that the game is still tough regardless of how you play through. On top of that you can tackle the levels in whatever order you'd like, and they all have a fun boss battle at the end. Right now you can pick up 30XTX for just $14.99, mark down 25% to a brand new low, and the deal ends on the 23rd. Virgo vs the Zodiac is a newer single player sci-fi themed JRPG. It has a download around 500 megabytes and offers players more than 15 hours of gameplay. The combat is what they call real-time turn-based, which just means that you're a bit more active in the combat than normal, meaning that timing your attacks and counters will be pretty important. We play as a queen named Virgo, and it's our job to restore peace to the world around us. The game encourages the player to explore for secrets, 
and there are multiple endings for replay value as well. There's even a cool shoot 'em up mini game to kill some time when you need to, and right now you can grab it up for just $14.99, marked down to a brand new low, and the deal ends on the 26th. Alright everyone, here are a few other great deals to check out while you're already on the eShop. This young soul seeks out a way to push back the withering and bring life back to our world. I'm leaving. really been thinking about anything. Alright everyone, that wraps up today's video. Thank you all for hanging out. Please remember, if you had a good time, leave a like on the video, subscribe if this was your first time here, but most importantly, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you on the next one.